For the last 20 years, there was a war going on between the Taliban, a terrorist group, and the Afghanistan government and military. They had first captured Kabul, the capital of Afghanistan, in 1996. They ruled Afghanistan between 1996 to 2001. During their rule, the Taliban ruthlessly governed the Afghani people. They had imposed the extremely strict Sharia law. Under the law, women were not allowed to work, study or go out. They were supposed to stay at home. Girls were not allowed to go to school. The rules were very severe. Women had to be accompanied by a male relative in public. The Afghan people were suffering under the extreme rules imposed by the Taliban regime. The Taliban were ruthless in their oppression and executed men and women for the smallest violation. People lived under fear for a long time. However, after 9-11 in 2001, the USA was livid and its army worked with the Afghanistan army. To expel the Taliban from Kabul. Since then, the Taliban lived in fear and there was peace. People were happy under the new government as well. However, recently the US called its troops back, which emboldened the Taliban to begin its encroachment activities. After the USA retreated, the Afghan government was not able to stop the Taliban from capturing the country. On the 9th of 15th August, police and other government security forces suddenly abandoned their uniforms and even weapons. They all feared the Taliban rebels. Thousands of security officials abandoned their posts. Then the Taliban captured the presidential palace. Afghanistan President Ashraf Ghani stepped down as the president and fled the country. Late at night, fighters in pickup trucks and SUVs did victory rounds in the heart of Kabul. Civilians panicked and left their homes. People packed all essential items, food, and emptied their bank accounts to escape the country. When the word of the Taliban's arrival spread, people panicked and there were massive traffic jams. People feared the imposition of the strict rules, this is why everyone wanted to leave the country. People rushed to various foreign embassies to secure visas to leave the country. There were traffic snarls everywhere. There was absolute chaos at the immigration counter of the Kabul airport as people rushed to leave the country. Various embassies rushed to evacuate their staff, fearing the Taliban's arrival. Many civilians also tried to escape. Air India flight took off from Kabul on 15th August and landed at Delhi airport last night. People were relieved to escape the new Taliban regime.
There were a total of 129 people on board. One of the women said that The Taliban are going to kill my friends. The women are going to be tortured as they do not have rights anymore. I am very scared for the women in Afghanistan. Another shocking news has emerged. At the Kabul airport, civilians flocked the tarmac desperately trying to board a US flight. They did this to evade the Taliban. The military tried to control the crowds but people rushed to enter the plane. Unable to contain the crowds, the army had to fire shots in the air. Have a look at the video clips.